As you guys know, the Samsung has scheduled an unpack event on September 23 in which it will unveil the Samsung Galaxy S20 FE, the fan edition. And we already know that it would be a lighter version of the Galaxy S20 series. Now today, continuing the leaks about the Galaxy S20 FE, the guys from the Greek website Technamiax has came up with some new leaks with the help of some local carrier insiders. Now talking about specification of the Alist Galaxy S20 FE, it would feature a 6.5 inch Full HD Plus Super AMOLED display with 405 ppi pixel density and a 6 GB of RAM, a primary camera setup with 12 megapixel wide angle camera, 12 megapixel ultra wide sensor and 8 megapixel telephoto sensor, while the front camera would be 32 megapixel. It is expected that it would support 4000 to 4500 milliamp hour battery and will have 15 watt charging. It is rumored that the Samsung would bring back the 3.5mm headphone jack on the Galaxy S20 FE while it would have a slightly lower build quality with plastic build and would feature a price tag of $700 to $750. Now moving on to the most important leak that happened today which is that the Galaxy S20 FE would be powered by the latest Snapdragon 865 Plus processor and not the Snapdragon 865 on the S20 models, which means the performance of the new affordable Galaxy S20 FE would be comparable to the Note 20 series in US and Korea, while the global version will only get the same Exynos 990 chipset on the S20 and the Note 20 series. The leakster also claims that the S20 FE will have a lighter aluminium frame and Samsung's plastic body material like the Note 20 just to keep the cost down. Another important information that has been revealed from today's leak is that the Galaxy S20 FE would indeed feature 120Hz display panel but it won't be the adaptive display which we saw on the Note 20 Ultra but rather it's the same LTPS technology which we saw on the S20 series. The leakster also claims that the S20 FE will have 12 megapixel main camera and will have f1.8 aperture while the 12 megapixel ultra wide camera will carry f2.2 aperture. Interestingly, this new source also reports that the Galaxy S20 FE would only have 4000 mAh battery but all of the leaks till now suggest it would have the same 4500 mAh battery from the S20 Plus which seems perfectly logical since the device is also having a larger 6.5 inch display. So guys if these leaks are true then the Samsung Galaxy S20 FE would be the cheapest smartphone from Samsung to feature a Snapdragon 865 Plus processor and that too at the price tag of around 700 US dollars. I will take it any day. So that's all for now. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, hit the like button, share with your friends and stay subscribed.